Eleven year old Indigo Huber doesn't do anything half baked. The money from this bake sale won't go to her piggy bank. I've seen things that make me cry, and I just I see people suffer. I just want to help them. The purpose of this mess is actually under the table. He really is just the best boy so far. This puppy named Pumpkin <laughs> is training to be Nora Pina's service dog. The seven-year-old suffers from drug-resistant epilepsy. We're hopeful that he'll be able to let us know before it happens so that way we can swipe the magnet and stop her daytime seizures. And at nighttime, Nora may not be able to communicate during a seizure. Having a dog that could sleep with her in her own room would give her a lot of independence and just us a lot of peace of mind knowing that she'll wake up again in the morning. The wait time for a fully trained service dog is about two years. We decided to find a dog ourselves and hopefully be able to train him faster that way. <laughs> it's faster, but expensive. As much as $20,000 at some facilities. She's going through a lot and it's really sad and horrible, but it makes me cry with happy tears that I can help her. Mom, I made pumpkin into a cookie. Indigo is one generous cookie. It was flooded. It was flooded everywhere. Water on the street. We caught up with her in 2017 when she sold lemonade for Hurricane Harvey relief. It's not embarrassment, but it's just happy embarrassment that I'm just like, yeah, I'm really good at this. But she is. And after 10 of these lemonade stands over the years, her hope for this one is the same. Yeah, at least some, some money in the jar and some full bellies because we don't leave all the cookies for the public. You didn't oh eat one. <laughs> so. Because Indigo refuses to accept the way the cookie crumbles. Cookie can make a big dent in the world. Indigo will be out here on Saturday. We've put the information on our website. In Lebanon, Andrew Rowan, WCPO 9 News.